G'day everyone, I'm Pete Evans and you're watching Garden Chef. The recipe I'm going to show you now is barbecued prawns with avocado salsa. So easy, great to do when it, the sun's shining, you've got guests over and you don't want to do too much work. So let's get started. First thing, prawns on the barbie or you can do it inside on a frying pan like this. Prawns go in. We're just going to cook them for about two minutes on each side just until they're cooked through. Next thing, salsa, what, what an elaborate version of a guacamole basically. It's chunky, it's a little bit rustic. Let's get into it. So, red onion, very finely sliced and diced. It's always important whenever you're using onion in a salad or a salsa, that it's really nice and fine, especially if it's raw that is. Otherwise it can be overpowering and you don't want that in, in a salsa. Okay, so we've got the onion. Next thing, the avocado. Now a lot of guacamole recipes call for it to be blended, whereas I like this so I can actually see the avocado and taste it and get that texture, that buttery richness of it. Okay, avocado's in there. Next thing, some lemon juice. In Mexico they probably use lime for this, but lemon is also fine. Oops, pip went in there, we'll get rid of that. Okay, some salt some pepper, and if you've got your own favourite way of making guacamole, then go for it. It is just prawns with guacamole. Okay, I'll well, just season them before I flip them. Salt, pepper, and uh, turn them over. Oh, they look gorgeous. Have a look at them. That's what we want. Perfect spring entertaining. All right, next thing, we've got some semi-dried tomatoes here. So a little bit of that goes into the salsa or guacamole. Some long red chilli, finely diced. Some roasted red capsicum. Excuse me. And some coriander. And just roughly put the knife through that. Again, you want to be able to taste the coriander. You don't, make, make, don't, you don't want to make it disappear. Okay, let's mix all that around. Look at that. Now to plate this up, you can either put it in a cookie cutter to make it look lovely and neat, make a nice bed for it, or you can just leave it nice and relaxed and loose, just on the plate like this. All right. With the prawns, we just interlock them. Basically like a yin and yang, just for a bit of presentation. Okay, and then pop them onto the salad. A little bit of coriander leaf in there. Some chilli oil to finish it off. It just brightens up the plate and gives it a good little kick. So there you have it, barbecued prawns with avocado salad. Perfect spring entertaining.